What's up YouTube? Today we're checking out the DJI Oswald Pocket 3 Creator Combo. Just picked this up today. Let's open it up and see what we got. Up first, it's a protective case for the gimbal. You can store the gimbal and the wide angle lens. Next up, it's the pouch of everything included. And there it is, the gimbal, the Osmo Pocket 3. Two inch rotatable screen. I decided to take this out. Next is the tripod adapter for the gimbal. the extended battery handle which can also be attached with a tripod there we go in the creator combo it does also come with the DJI Mic 2 the wide angle lens that's everything fits all in the pouch see what this camera can do. So today, we're actually gonna test this camera out at the anime convention here, take us through its paces. Let's go. Let's start at this thing and make our way down. So we'll definitely be trying out all the different features of the Osmo. Definitely the 4K24, 4K60. So yeah, we got the slow light, slow motion. We're going to try hyperlapse today. Alright. So now we're going to test out the slow motion feature on the Osmo Pocket 3. Osmo Pocket shoot 4K 120 with a 1080p at 240. Um, today I'm just going to stick with the 4K 120. Get as much detail and slow mo as some of the cosplayers. So the cool thing is this 
has a auto face detect feature. So, if I stand in place, it is tracking my every movement. So, perfect vlog camera. Uh, I can focus walking in front and I know the camera will stay locked on my face. Um, so I'm trying to navigate through the crowds here at Comic-Con. But checking out all the different booths and stalls and what they're selling. So that was the con. Uh, we're gonna make our way now to this ramen spot that I've heard of. Check out what we can get there, apart from the ramen. <laughs> yeah, there's a couple more features. Definitely want to be trying on this on this vlogging camera, but so far. It's pretty awesome. I mean, again, with the face tracking, uh, you can't beat it as a vlog camera, right? <laughs> feature or low light mode on this camera is pretty spot on. I mean the fact that it's a that one inch sensor really really helps with the low light. So but yeah, uh, got some shots here and as you can see I mean a low light. go over is actually very important and pretty cool for content creators such as me and you but um, yeah vertical uh, with just a simple flick of the screen go from 4k then when you just flick the screen uh, to the vertical you'll see it goes from 4k whole to 3k 